Hey y'all, uh, this is Leslie and I have another massive haul. I don't normally spend this much at Christmas, but I have not shopped very much this, this year. And so my crafty spending uh, kind of has shown up here at the end of the year. Um, I get money at Christmas and my birthday's in January. And so that money gets used to, to buy stuff throughout the year. And if I don't go shopping very much, I have money left over at the end of the year. Plus, I sold some stuff, and so, you know, I had a little money to throw away that way. Um, I have got, <laughs> this is, this, this haul that I'm about to show you covers Cracker Barrel, because they have a awesome 70% um, off corner in, in the store when you go in. It's all the way in the very right corner of the uh, shopping area amazing stuff that you can find, especially um, clothes and, and things for kids and adults. Uh, and then, let's see, I went to Hobby Lobby, I went to Michael's, I went to Kohl's, I went to Dollar Tree, and I went to somewhere else, Target. So, let's get started. Um, it's going to be here and there, and so I'll just let you know. Here's a cute little pumpkin. I love it. It's got the um, place for the photo holder. They were used for um, place cards, but um, it's got the photo holder. This was from Hobby Lobby, uh, and it was the um, in the 90% off section. This was also in the 90% off section. This is some confetti, and um, my daughter told me about a little um, cute idea to do with these, so I've got a plan for that. Um, I like these sleeves. I don't normally like the little package sleeves, but I like these, and so I thought, okay, that would be good. Um, then I got this. This was um, this is letterboard icons and words, but I thought this would be good. I got a friend who loves to do cards, and um, again, it was 90% off, so I paid a dollar for it, and I thought, okay, you know what? These would be good for... Um, to use as a sticker. Now they have the little peg. Can you see the little pegs on the? Yeah, I think you can see that. Um, they have the little pegs, but you can snip those off with scissors and um, then they could be used like a sticker. Just glue them on. So I thought those were really cute. Kind of like a die cut, but um, a little bigger. So there's a couple more pumpkins. Um, let's see what else. Oh, for crying out loud, I don't even know which way to go. Okay, well, this is in my way, so let's do this. Okay, the whole reason we went shopping in the first place is because I wanted this uh, nativity set. My oldest daughter got one because she wanted um, a nativity, and she doesn't have any. And um, I have a collection of nativities, but most of them are from dollar stores. And when I say dollar stores, they look like they're from dollar stores, okay? Okay. And then I've got a couple that are, you know, old antique ones. So I really like this one because I thought, okay, I can get rid of one of my dollar store ones and use this. Even though I probably won't end up getting rid of the dollar store one. I have a nice little table that I put these on. And if if you all want to see um, my Christmas decorations, you can leave me a comment below. And I'll think about cleaning up the house and, and doing a little walkthrough of it. Um, in Hobby Lobby, I always go over to the um, floral section to the, not the floral section, the fabric section and go over to their um, remnants bin and just kind of check through and just see what's there. And they have these Aunt Martha iron-on transfers. Not that I'm going to do any iron-ons, but these are great to use as a journaling card. Um, so, okay, apparently I can't open it, but it's just a piece of paper. Pull it out. There we go. I can pull it out now. See? They're just pieces of paper. It's a, a thin sort of paper. And they're perfect. So, I love this. Uh, I've seen a couple of people use these. I came across these. Um, most of the people I've seen use them. Use them at... Uh, use their 40% off coupon uh, to get it. And I got them, you know, when they were on sale for 50 cents. I just stopped because I have a, um, I'm, I'm getting ready to rust some things. And you see the bubbles that are forming in here. Um, this is salt and vinegar. If you want to know about this process, I'll, I'll do it. But I had to actually release the pressure 
because I could hear it hissing and I didn't want it to explode on me in the middle of the video. Okay. Now, <laughs> okay, what else we got here? Okay, we got this paw print ornament. We're not going to use it um, for the dog. Well, we might if there's enough left over um, because we do have a, a puppy that we love. Um, well, she's seven years old. And, but the plan is to do it with my grandson's um, foot, and that will be his um, first year craft Christmas ornament. When I went to Cracker Barrel and I went to their 50% off section, they always have these little um, salt and pepper shakers, and they're a dollar normal, but then they will put them back there for 70% off. And so, you know, these are super cute, and they can, you know, be used because this is kind of the style of my house anyway so i thought those were really precious this one he um shakes from the side which i kind of thought was weird but okay that's that a cute little pumpkin one i just think that's just cute a pumpkin magnet oh and it's a jiggly magnet 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 <laughs> and then i had to get an outfit for my son uh grandson and um, it, it was 70% off, and it was $17, so 70% off of that. And Oh, wait, no. This was 80% off. And um, so anyway, I always go over there because they usually have cute things, and I can get an outfit like this for 5 bucks, which I did, or less than 5 bucks actually. And then, um, you know, got a good present, and that'll be for his first birthday. Okay, continuing on, I got one of these at Cracker Barrel as well. I just thought it was really pretty. You know, it's just a sitter, but it's cute. You know, it would be cute with the little pumpkin sitting on top. I don't know. Yeah. Um, then, also in Cracker Barrel, they had um, this magnifying glass. And I'm doing the um, Sherlock Holmes journal for my dad. And I thought this will be beautiful. I want to do it in a leather bound cover. So I'm looking for, you know, something um, to use for that. And I thought if I if I did little leather straps that went around, wrapped a few times and tied, then this could be like tied to it. I thought this was just gorgeous. And it's it's in that kind of rustic look. And of course, it's a really good magnifier too. But, um... So anyway, I got that um, to go with my dad's uh, Sherlock Holmes journal, and I just thought it was really pretty. And it was 60% off. Okay, then I went to Kohl's, and I'm going to give you some tips here. Kohl's had their ornaments and things 50% off, and some of them were 60% off. Well, this is a um, photo note clip holder. It's, it says, well, I don't, I'm not going to use it that way. I just, you know, of course I'm going to use the red truck. And this was the part that goes in the back here like this, like this. And, you know, that's cute, but that's very Christmas. And so if you don't want to use it for Christmas, it will pop out. And this one happened to be just laying out beside the truck. And so um, I asked the lady and she gave me um, another 25% off of this um, so it was um, $14 regular 50% off that 70 and I'm um, excuse me seven dollars and then she gave me 25% off of that so I ended up paying like five bucks for it then um, there was this one and it's the same thing it does not have the items in the back and it does not have the photo holder um, clip which for me my purposes does not matter so I asked the lady, I said, okay, how much th for this one? And um, so I ended up getting this one for 90% off. So this uh, was normally um, $14, so I paid $1.40 for this in this little metal truck. So, you know, I'm, on, I'm, I'm getting everything I can this Christmas in case this whole farmhouse thing expires and, and goes out of style for everybody next year. Um, it won't be for me, but, you know, for everybody else it might. They might be tired of it by next year saw this is too cute it reminds me this would be my grandson's first christmas ornament on my tree and i just thought that was too cute just so precious little wagon we have one of those wagons by the way um for my grandson's first christmas um photo i wanted to get a little ornament for that that i can put out each year so i picked up this little one it was 60 percent off 
Again, this was 60% off as well. I got this for my daughter's tree. Um, and then, um, look at this. How cute is this? This is so totally my house. Um, we, uh, not my house, my style. Um, we actually, my family used to own a dairy barn that was red and looked like this. And we um, had cows. It was a dairy farm. And so we milked the cows and, um, you know, had the um, fields of the grain and everything. And so, you know, that's where my farmhouse comes from is because that's where I felt most at home. And now I've moved up here and I live on that land. So there we go. The barn burned years ago. Okay, what's next? Okay, let's see. I've shown you guys this, but I picked up this at Dollar Tree. Daisy, no, it's nothing. I picked up this at Dollar Tree, and it has this 3D item on top. I'm not sure about the farmer's market, but I can always pop this off and use it. So, it was really cute, so I picked it up. Look at these bags. Is that like not the cutest thing ever? Oh, so I picked up a bunch of those. There's like five of those. <laughs> um, I picked up a placemat because I have a plan for this. I picked up an ugly placemat because I have a plan for it. I picked up a jot zipper pocket because I have a plan for it. I picked up, let's see, a um, pack of these report covers because I have a plan for that and a um, folder because I have a plan for it. Um, I got, let's see, what else? I'm gonna have to clear this spot. I got this bag, there's two of those. And, okay, yeah, let's clear a spot and then I will be right back. 